Hi, I'm Ellie Steele from evolutionwellness.ca and today's EFT tap along video is a general one for stress. So I wanted to do this video so that you can use it for just about anything that's happening in your life that you feel stress about. So we're going to be doing some general EFT tapping. Now if you're not familiar with what EFT is or how to do the tapping, I suggest you have a look at some of the other videos on my website evolutionwellness.ca and just learn the basic technique and the tapping points and then come back and you can do this video with me. So it doesn't matter what your stress is, we're just going to tune into it and we're going to tap in general on that. Now the more specific you can be with EFT, usually the better your results. Um, but to keep this nice and broad and easy, we're just going to do some general tapping on stress and anxiety. So it doesn't matter what this stress is. It could be stress eating, things that cause you to eat when you don't want to eat. Um, it could be relationship stuff, you know, it could be work stuff, kids stuff, money problems, body image, just feeling negative emotion. Really anything that causes negative emotion, we can call stress for our purposes today. So the first thing I want you to do is get in mind whatever is causing you stress at this moment. So giving that a 0 to 10 rating, 10 being the most stressful thing that has ever happened to you and 0 being absolutely not stressed about it at all and just calm and relaxed and cool about it. So give yourself a 0 to 10 rating and also try to feel where it is in your body. You know, is it a lump in your throat? Is it tightness in your chest or is it a knot in your stomach, you know? Maybe it's just tension and tightness all around your shoulders. So we're just going to tune into where it is in our body and what number is that stress. And you know what these stressors are. So be specific when you're thinking about it. You know, maybe it's this not feeling good about my relationship with my boss, or maybe I had this fight with my spouse. Something specific like that. Okay, so get that in mind. Give it a 0 to 10 rating. And then we're going to tap along with me. Now, of course, by tapping along, you are agreeing to the terms of service on my website at evolutionwellness.ca. Please take responsibility for your own emotional health. And if this is causing undue emotional uh, stress, then leave it alone for now. Okay? So we'll start by tapping, sorry, by rubbing on the sore spot on the chest. And you can use this interchangeably with the karate chop point, which is tapping on the side of the hand. I prefer the chest, um, but whatever feels comfortable for you. Even though I feel this stress, I love and I accept myself completely. Even though I have all of this stress, I love and I accept myself completely. Even though I feel so much stress over this, I love myself and I accept myself completely. Okay, now tapping on the inside corner of the eyebrow, this stress this stressful feeling in my body. And again, tune into wherever, whatever it is in your body. This stressful feeling in my body. I have so much stress over this. I like the idea of feeling better. But there's so much stress. I don't know how to feel better about this but I like the idea of relaxing and feeling better. Okay, stop there and take a breath. And then we're gonna check it. So give it another zero to 10 rating. And if it hasn't dropped at all, that's fine. Check where it is in your body. Maybe it's moved around. If it was in your throat, maybe it's moved down to your chest or it can be very subtle, but just take stock of it and see where it is. And maybe it's even changed aspects a little bit. So it might, uh, it might shift a little bit into, first I was stressed about this argument I had with my husband this morning, and now it's more about, it's the same as that time that he did that five years ago. All right, so it's, it's kind of triggering other memories or other things. So that's part of the process of different aspects when we're looking, when we're tapping with EFT. So be aware of that and how it's shifting in your mind into something else. Now we're going to do another round here now, going back to the sore spot. Even though I still have a lot of this stress, I love and I accept myself anyways. And I like the idea that I can do something about it. Even though I still have all of this stress, I love and I accept myself anyways. Even though there's still stress in my body, and in my mind, 
I like the idea that I can relax about this. Now you can switch hands if you want to and do the other side, or you can do both at the same time. Whatever's comfortable for you, it's fine. I still have this stress. I'm still so stressed about this. This remaining stress. I'm still feeling stressed about this. I do like the idea of feeling better. I like having the power and control to change the way I feel. I like knowing that I can release this stress. There are lots of things in my life that are working well for me. Okay, stop there and take a breath. Now we're starting to move it into the positive, right? And if you're not quite feeling it yet, if you're just still focused on the stress, then just rewind and go back and tap again on the initial round. Um, the initial two rounds and get you to this place where you're feeling like, okay, this is starting to lessen a little bit. When it's starting to lessen, then we can really get in there and start to shift it into something more positive. When you understand law of attraction, you get it, <laughs> that how you feel in any moment is what it's all about. This is your life right now. In this moment, this is it. You can't live in the past or in the future. So this is where you need to be happy. This is where you need to be calm and relaxed. This is the only place you can be calm and relaxed. So use that as your motivation to right now, no matter what's happening in your life, find a way to be calm and relaxed. And use that as the evidence that you're manifesting exactly what you want in your life. Okay, so now we're going to do a little bit more positive round and move you into that place. Even though I still have some of this stress left, I choose to know that this is my now. This is my life. And if I want to be happy, it has to happen right now. Even though I still have some of this stress from this thing in my life, I choose to know there's always going to be stress. There's always going to be stuff that I could be upset about. But is that really the way I want to live? That may be the way I'm used to living, but it doesn't have to be that way anymore. I still have some of this stress, but I choose to know I can be calm and relaxed. I can ease into life and let this irritation fall by the wayside. Any of this remaining stress, it's just not worth it. Whatever I'm stressed about is just not worth it. I want to be calm. I want to be relaxed. I want to feel good. Every moment that I feel good is a successful moment in my life. And I can feel good right now. There's always something to feel good about. What can I feel good about today? I like the idea that I can feel good. I like the idea that I can relax about all of this and live in the power of this moment. I want to know that life takes care of itself and all I can do is relax. And when I relax, I see solutions. I see ways that life can be even better. And then I can take action from this place of feeling good. I love feeling relief. I love knowing that life is supposed to be fun. Okay, stop there and take a breath. So feel free to go back and tap on that again and just get feeling better and better and better. So like I said, use this tapping video for whatever is bothering you in your life and start to shift your emotions up the emotional guidance scale. 
If you're feeling anger, maybe even reach for a little feeling of revenge because it's a higher vibrational emotion, right? And then from there, you might reach into a feeling of frustration. And then from there, you might reach into a feeling of hope, right? So you don't necessarily try to make a quantum leap up that emotional scale. You can just take it rung by rung. But EFT tapping can get you there much more quickly because we're reducing your fight or flight response. We're allowing you to see clearly and really get in touch with what's important to you. And that's having a fun, good life. Okay, so have a great day, happy tapping, and please come back and use this video often.